it was a uh, it was tough it wasn't easy especially with the whole transition of going to college um you know playing on a new team in a new town being away from home being away from, i'm four hours away and i was still getting homesick i'm kind of yeah. body in that way but um you know it was a it was a tough process and there it was there were times where i was thinking about transferring um once i made the switch it was my decision at the end of the day but once i made the switch to defense i was like man what did i get myself into yeah. And for me, I, I was really set on um, playing quarterback just because I felt like I'd put in so much time um, doing going to camps, going out of state, going to training every, on Sundays and Saturdays, mm -hmm. early morning, and just all this stuff, quarterback camps, quarterback this, quarterback that, studying. Because right. um, you were at the lead 11, right? Right. I was at one. Of, I got invited to a couple of the uh, like qualifying things. I wasn't got on you. the actual finals, but um, – but yeah, just stuff like that, Still, little camps yeah. and little things like that, where I was like, man, I put in so much work to be a quarterback. Bazu yeah. came in, mm -hmm. and they said, well, yeah, we want you, but as an athlete. Mm -hmm. And I know I knew what that meant. <laughs> I knew what that meant, and I was like, well, does that mean I get to play some quarterback, or like, will I get my shot at quarterback? And they're like, yeah. They didn't really say <laughs> that's about it. But I knew I knew kind of what was coming. Um, but I decided I was gonna at least go, you know, play some quarterback for a bit. Um, and it started to make sense to me why they wanted me to play on defense or wanted me to play special teams or whatever when I was there. And I have a, the the different frame than all these quarterbacks. Mm -hmm. Everybody just standing back there in the pocket, mm -hmm. dinking and dunking. <laughs> and all I wanted to do was tuck it and run, tuck it and run or, <laughs> you know, um, run some read option or something. Um, so it was a little bit different. Um and that's when I started to notice, like, maybe this isn't the best fit for me. So it came to a point, I think, like, the third or fourth day in camp where uh, one of our coach, offensive coaches um, brought me in, and he was like, look, I know you want to play quarterback. You can play quarterback. You'll get on the field as a freshman if you switch to defense. Mm -hmm. um, and so at that point, I was kind of like, yeah, I guess I could see myself. And I'd been a defensive player growing up all my life. My first position was middle linebacker as mm -hmm. a kid. And it was just like, go tackle the ball. So yeah. I was just running, hit the ball, whatever <laughs> it was. So I'm in a, growing up and all the way through, and in high school even, I played some safety. And um, so it was – I had defense in my blood too. But um, it was still tough. So I was I was like, all right, I'll do it. Um, get on the field hopefully this year and uh, get out there. It was just – it was, yeah, it was a tough transition playing D1 ball, um, going from – I remember <laughs> – there are times when I look back and we're talking about, you know, failing um, mm -hmm. early and failing, you know, often and learning from that in the flow state and everything. Yeah. Man, I've never been so far from flow in my life. When I, was first. <laughs> I look back on like film. I remember later in my career looking back on, oh, I wonder what it was like my first couple of weeks on defense. Mm -hmm. I didn't know how to, my stance was all out of whack. <laughs> I didn't know how to cover anybody. I didn't know how to do anything. Um, and that's just part of the deal. And, it, mm -hmm. you know, we fast forward and I was a three year starter um, at the end for the last three years. So um, it's just a, it's a process. And for me, it was about, you know, when it got to that point of I really think I want to transfer and go play quarterback somewhere. It was, you know, I have this opportunity to play Pac-12 football at a school that I loved growing up that my mm -hmm. dad, my parents met at. Two of my sisters went here. Mm -hmm. And Coach Leach has just come in, and things seem to be really on the upswing, and he's got a whole plan, and he's serious about changing this culture. And at the end of the day, that's what we did. Um, going from no bowl games in 10 years to four while I was there uh, in five years is, is uh, I'd say that was a successful you know, uh, yeah. tenure there. So um, we accomplished what we wanted to as a recruiting class, and I was glad to have, play a big part in that, whether it was on the offense or defensive side of the ball.